Hello, this is Mr. Corsi. Today we're going to learn how to create a animated GIF image and insert it as an image on a web page. First thing you need to do is find the directions on the creating an animated GIF horse animation handout and follow the directions exactly. Uh, there's a part one on the first page and a part two on the second page. The first thing you need to do is copy the files for this project. You're going to have to go to the Group Home, Web, Documents, Project Files, and there's a folder called Horse Animation that contains three files for this assignment. All you need to do is copy this folder and paste it in your third six weeks folder. I'm pasting it on the desktop for the purposes of this tutorial. Once your horse animation folder is copied, you're going to have to open up fireworks on the dock. It's the FW and the orange box. Then you're going to go File, Open, then you find your horse animation folder that you copied and you're going to select all three by holding down shift after clicking on the first one you click the third one and hold down shift. The big important thing is you need to have this open as animation box checked. This allows you to open all three and they're going to be contained within one file. So click open and this is what happens. When you open it it should look something like this. You, you got a picture of a horse and at the bottom you got what I call VCR buttons. You can hit play and what happens is it has all three images playing back and forth and really what they are is if you go window and make sure states is open this used to be frames in previous versions but uh, you got state one is image one, two, image two, three, image three and put them together and they appear animating. Now as you see the horse is running backwards so let's fix that. Let's move state 3 to where state 2 is. So now you click play and it looks like the horse is running correctly. One more thing I want to talk to you about is uh, the timing of the state delay which is over here. You notice if you hit play it animates pretty fast but you can uh, speed that up or slow it down. If The higher it goes if I, I'll change that one to 50. You'll watch and you'll it looks like he's stutter stepping. Or you can speed it up and it's even faster. I'm going to change it back. Now to export this all you need to do is just go file image preview make sure that the format is animated GIF because this isn't a normal GIF it's one that animates and it has to be set that way in order for this to work and then you click the export button and what you're going to do is you need to find the horse animation folder that you copied not the original one but but the one that you copied and you're going to save this as just horse.gif horse.gif and make sure you don't save it over any of those and then click export after you've closed fireworks you don't have to save it you should see in your new horse animation folder that you have a new image horse.gif you can preview it in Safari make sure it works now we're not quite done we haven't made our web page and that's part two what you're going to need to do is open up BB Edit, file new HTML document, put your name you need to spell it right, horse animation click OK and then what you're going to need to do is type a level one header, align center and type horse animation, close it and then you're going to do a paragraph tag, a line center, and do an image tag, horse.gif, and then close it. And then the main thing is, I haven't saved it yet, so the image doesn't show up. What I'm going to have to do is go File, Save As, find my horse animation folder on my desktop, and call it 
horse.html. Now once it has a point of reference saved right next to this horse.gif, that's where the source is. And it should show up now. And that is your finished product.